Okay. This is the Petra climb, or I guess it's more of a hike, video number one. There's our guide. Alright, maybe the guys can interrupt us. So. And to talk about all of it in one place instead of forgive. wasting the time of stopping and gathering every time. So just take pictures now from the and we're going to talk about the details of all of it when we stop down there. Okay. Uh, forgive me if I'm uh, tired. The party, the first bus didn't leave the party last night till 10 o'clock, so I got to bed around 11, but they woke us up at, we had to get up at 4 a.m. to leave, and then so went to the airport, and then there was a flight, and buses, and I don't know, there's been a couple of half-hour buses somewhere, and now we just got off a two-hour bus, can't really sleep. And then the day before, on Saturday, I climbed Masada, I believe at 5 a.m. or something. Anyway, so it's just, this is brutal. Very grueling. And uh, we didn't really know there was going to be an eight-mile hike. We're all like, wait, what? I think I was under the impression we would just sort of, you know, walk through a gate, check out some old relics, and go for lunch. But no, I feel like this is actually like we're Indiana Jones or something. And, uh... I don't know, maybe I should start going on seniors tours. I think those might be more relaxing. Anyway, uh, I'm wearing a scarf on my head to protect myself from the sun. I just bought it at the last, uh, like we stopped at sort of a gift shop thing on the way on the bus. And uh, I figured, you know, this must be my last chance to buy sort of a, a scarf for my head. But oh, look at this. <laughs> I literally did not plan that right now. Um, I, I was just talking about the scars, and then they, they showed up. Uh, what I was going to say was back there, like not right here, but when we parked the bus, there was more scarf areas, and a guy ran out, and he was yelling, yeah, you're with a bad man, because our guide told us, don't buy anything at the uh, at the gift shop, like at the base of the thing, because he's like, oh, they, they ripped you off. Uh, but the, the bad, the guy who yeah, came up to me, he said, you're with a bad man, your guide says don't buy with us just because uh, we don't give him commission and look at the sign, we give the money to uh, the families around here and everything. And he's like, how much did you pay for your scarf? I'm like, 17 uh, or 72 shekels. He's like, no, it should be like, uh, you know, three dinar, five dollars, like uh, 20 shekels or something. I'm like, oh, crap, so I just got screwed in Jordan. Yeah. But uh, I'm sure there's worse ways to be screwed here. Uh, but it's looking pretty nice so far. I guess I'll listen to the actual guide.